Are you a dad who's thought about getting an Apple Watch to make you a little more productive and maybe even make you a little more engaged with your kids and your family while still being productive? Hi there, I'm Josh and this is the Productivity Test Kitchen. We're here in the kitchen, my kitchen, and I am here with my co-host, the Ninja and the Ninja in training. The Ninja and Boda are here to help me talk to you about how to be productive with an Apple Watch. There's certain things that as a parent you need to do. You can do those things on your Apple Watch in the moment without disengaging, without having to run grab your laptop or be on your phone. <laughs> and for me, it's all about the Apple Watch custom faces. This is the custom screen that Apple Watch gives you that just allows you to load in all the things that you prefer um, in the different categories. So I have the date up in the corner, I have the time up in the other corner. In the center I have my calendar and it'll actually tell me what um, what the next event is and what's coming up. Over here I've got the battery percentage and all of this is completely customizable. And here I've got my text messages. I think that's incredibly useful to have text messages here. This one down here in the corner says IFTTT. -T -T. This is my grocery list. So as I am going through the house normally um, working in the bathroom or the kitchen, I realize, oh darn, we need to get um, soap for the dishwasher. So I can click that right there and it loads up a custom screen. This right here is something I've set up with Trello and all I do is hit that and then it allows me to record a custom message just with my voice. And off that goes to my grocery list. That'll be interesting. Okay, so that is one whole custom face that I've designed. If I swipe over here, this is another custom face I've designed. Everything here is related to time. I have a timer, I have a stopwatch, and I have an alarm. This is often a timeout timer. That's, that's typically what we use it for. In addition to cooking and everything else, it's nice to have it right there on your watch. What's great about it is I can click it, I can hit the time, and it'll show it to me in the timer app there, but then I can go to my watch face and the timer app is right there on my watch face. Even down in this tiny little widget of the timer, you can see that time going. Uh, same goes for the stopwatch. So I can start a stopwatch here, it shows it in the app. I go back to my custom watch face and I can see it counting up and counting down at the same time. You can do both of those things all from this one custom face. And uh, the last one I have, I've got basically a fitness and exercise page. So it gives me my heart rate. Um, this is my little counter for my steps and exercise and also an exercise app. I'm gonna show you real quick um, how you can customize them right here from the Apple Watch. If you just hold down, I can hit customize and it takes me into the customizing mode right here. So right now it's giving me the choice of do I wanna do multicolor or change the colors and I can actually scroll through. Um, I can select okay and then swipe over. Now it's gonna allow me to actually select each individual category. So if I wanted something other than the date there, I could scroll and I say, oh, hey, it pulls up my favorite person, that's my wife. It can pull up find my friends, it can pull up my heart rate. I can change that right from here, an incredible number of options. And I can also change what's here in the middle. I've got my, it's, it's basically the same set of options, but depending on the location, they might look a little different. I can know that the moon is currently a waxing crescent. I don't personally find that useful, but some people might. And it's the same thing with each of these. Now I hope you found that helpful, and I hope that allows you to be a little more productive, a little more engaged as a parent. If you wanna know more about the Apple Watch, if you want a few more tips about custom watch faces and other tips, I really encourage you to check out Elliot's video that he did here for the Productivity Test Kitchen, and you're gonna see it floating right above the ninja's head. Oh, oh my gosh, Grogu is causing the video to float. He can do the floss. <laughs> Please check out that video. I think you'll find a lot of useful tips about the Apple Watch, hit that subscribe button, hit that like button. Let me know what you think in the comments and we will see you next time.